Hi, today I thought I'll take a topic of non-reacting. This is part of the meditation philosophy where we are discussing how to remove negative thoughts and negative thoughts are coming from different qualities of human being. Uh, one of that is that we tend to react. So we'll try to understand why we should not react to any situation and that's come that comes from detachment and being with yourself, not uh, attached to anything around you, not reacting to anything around you. Why we don't should not react to anything around us is because it uh, we, we cannot change uh, what is happening. We cannot control it. It is part of the destiny. It's a part of the collective destiny. If you come inside the house, then you say, it's, uh, uh, you know, it, it does impact me. It impacts only when you react. Because again, also at micro level, if you if you don't react, why you should not react is because the person who's uh, you are reacting to somebody's action, you are reacting to something some, some something in which is due to somebody's action. Either it is an outcome of someone's action. Uh, you come home, you don't like something. Something is lying not the way it should be lying because somebody else kept it like that. Or when you see somebody doing something in the way which you don't like, you react. Or somebody says something to you in a kind of aggressive way, you don't, you react. But understand, by reacting, it's only troubling you. It's only uh, causing unhappiness. And that's the negative thought which gets generated because you, you don't agree to the person's way of doing it. You don't understand why somebody is has done it that way because you, you cannot change those people. You, you have to accept them. Acceptance is something very important. And they are doing it because they are in a certain frame of mind and they, f they felt it is to be done that way, so they did it. You cannot be micromanaging everything. You cannot be micromanaging this world or a community or maybe at your house or your office. In office there are certain rules and in off in home we generally dilute all the rules and in the absence of all the rules people behave in a certain way so we all are at a fault that we have not created a proper system in running the house so most of the problems occur at house the thing is in realizing the situation we should basically accept uh, the way people are and try to focus in our work and if we can do that, we can live in the present and we don't react to anything around us because it's all part of a destiny. We cannot change the destiny, we cannot change the people. People. We can only change something in ourselves. If we, if, if best to find what is that which, which we are doing in a wrong way. And if we can find that, we can at least change that. But we cannot change somebody doing wrong in a wrong way as per you. As per them, it may be the right way. So, uh, you know, maybe we can, you can do a different way of communicating that, which is the best way. That's another aspect of how you communicate and how you make things different. You know, how, how can you change people, uh, try to change people in, in a kind of collaborative way. That's very different. First thing is to change yourself. So, coming back to reaction, don't react because everybody is acting and nobody wants to be controlled. So if you react, you try, you, you'll try to control, then it'll create further problem, more negative thoughts. So, so then it'll lead to frustration and anger. So best is to, ultimately you are only getting harm by reacting. So stop reacting. When you stop reacting, you start accepting. When you start accepting, things happen. Nothing changes in the world. It keeps happening the way it is, the way it is to happen. So if, if other person is going to change the way you are, imagine the, the other person also must be wanting to do a lot of things uh, their way but you know you, you you will not like it if somebody keeps telling you so accept adopt and keep moving and see how it, how everyone evolves and maybe things improve if they don't accept it again again it's a destiny that's your destiny that's the, your life is going to be like this so you we, we try to change ourselves and leave it to others and then when when you start changing it when you stop reacting, then people start accepting you. When they, you are accepted, then they are willing to even change. So that's the best approach. Thanks.